Just after 1 p.m. today, Scott Charles succumbed at the Carl Hirschner Memorial Hospital while receiving treatment for gunshot wounds to the abdomen and chest. The 24-year-old fisherman and Belizean tour guide was inside his house in the Bayside area of San Pedro when someone came knocking at the door. When he opened it, he would be greeted by a barrage of bullets. Here at home, the house, um, and I guess you heard a boat pull up in the back and he came up to see who it was, who came for his friend, and I thought when he got his son of last night. So a group of men came at him last night at his home. Now, how many times was he shot, ma'am? Okay, my understanding is that he got shot three times, two in the abdomen and one in his face. Charles was rushed to the San Pedro Polyclinic before being airlifted to the KTMH for emergency surgery. But according to the family, his heart gave in during the operation and he was placed on life support until this afternoon when they were called in and informed of his demise. He was put on life support and that was after one, he, his heart failed. Yes, it's a shock because um, I just, he just buried my sister. Five months ago. And after my sister, I buried my my other nephew passed away, and now you know it's hard to know that we have another family. While speculation abounds, the police continue their investigation into this latest homicide on the island. But who could have wanted Charles dead and would be brazen enough to attack him as he was at home with his wife and their six month old baby? That's what I'm not quite sure. And he lives in San Pedro, and I'm in the city. Yeah. I'm not sure what he's like, what he's like out there in San Pedro. But definitely the family is looking for justice uh, for his life, right? We would like justice, but we believe in God, and I think we will leave everything in the sun so that he can do what he has to do with whoever, whoever, or whoever the person, that person is that with this. Twain Moody for News 5.